Is short selling finally coming to Jamaica? The Jamaica Stock Exchange has given us another timeline, but will they stick to it this time? I'm Khalilo Reynolds, financial journalist and educator based in Jamaica. So if you don't know what short selling is, here's a quick lesson. Short selling, also known as shorting, is an investment strategy that you would use if you expect a stock price to go down. Most of the time, we buy a stock with the hopes that the price will go up, right? You usually want to buy low and sell high, but with short selling, you're doing the reverse. You're betting against the stock. That way you can make money when stocks go up and when they go down. So with this strategy, you'll actually borrow the stock from someone else and sell it. Let's say you sell it for $100. Then later, let's say the price falls to $50. Now you can buy it back for 50 and give it back to the person that you borrowed it from and keep the extra 50 that you sold it for in the first place. Sounds crafty, right? Well, it's also very risky because what if the price doesn't fall? What if it goes up and you don't have the money to buy back the stock? Then you're in trouble. So it's a very high risk, high reward type of strategy because you can really make big gains. But on the other hand, losses can pile up quickly and you can even end up in debt, end up owing. So shorting is quite common in countries like the United States, which have larger markets and where trading is more robust. There's even an entire movie about it called The Big Short, based on probably the most famous use of this strategy during the financial crisis of 0708. It's a must watch for serious investors. So for years now, the JSE has been promising that shorting is coming to Jamaica. In their latest update, they're saying it will be available on the local stock exchange by the end of this year, 2023. Hmm. When have I heard this before? Next year, because we know that the platform is so built to allow, we'll be having short selling, we'll be having margin trading, and we'll be looking on options. What's the timeline on, on actually allowing this, Andre? We're, we're trying to get it done by December, but I would say um, the absolute latest would be January. So let's see if they stick to the timeline this time around. In its latest update, the JSC said it's finalizing the rules that will be used to govern shorting. Obviously, because our market is so small, we're going to need some rules. Last year, we interviewed the JSC's Group Business Development Manager, Andre Gooden. He explains that you will not be able to use this strategy with every stock. It will only be allowed with those that are very liquid. Think TJH and NCB, for example. Those are stocks that trade a lot of volumes. By the way, you can check out that full interview on my YouTube channel. Now remember, shorting is a risky game and the JSC wants to make sure that they're protecting investors and the exchange, especially now because the market is still fragile after SSL. So are you looking forward to short selling in Jamaica or is this strategy too risky for you? Let me know in the comments. Subscribe to my newsletter for money news like this straight to your inbox. Click the link up here or in the description below. Let's get this money.